Uh, my name is Stacey Leilua and you know, for this project Pink the Garden I was working um, on it as a co-producer and then uh, got cast in the role as well as uh, Louisa. So Pink the Garden was a play that has always been um, somewhere in the recesses of my mind that I would really have hoped to have um, been in one day ever since I saw it as an 11 year old. In 1993, I was taken to the Watershed Theatre with my dad and my grandmother and we sat and we watched this play. It was my first time seeing it and it, it really just left um, an impression on me because for the first time I was seeing Pacific people on stage. I still, and still now I have these images of like Lani Tupu in his cream suit and um, it, you know, there's, all, there's still images from that show watching it, I, I still remember. So the years go on and I, get, and I went to drama school and after drama school I, I, I connected with Anna Pella and I was 20 years old at the time. And it came to light that she was actually working as a theatre usher for that production in 93. And she would have been about 19 years old. And so all of these discussions took place and then um, last year she said um, that she was able to secure the rights uh, from Play Market to put the show on and you know would you be interested in producing? I said yes, yes, yes. <laughs> I just well, without a doubt I was like what, wasn't even you know anything to think of. So I said yeah definitely. So here we are it's kind of like full circle but the play itself is um, yeah it's always been special to me in that sense. <laughs> It's such a rich play and I guess in terms of the text and how it sort of carries itself, it's very poetic. It's a really a Samoan classic and I don't know um, about how many other plays we can really say that to. I just completed in 92. Um, and you read the text and I, for the first time revisiting it as an adult and reading this text, I just, you know, it's just moving. Um, obviously it's set against the backdrop of um, you know, the events of 1929 and Black Saturday and so it's very emotive. I think audiences will really be transported to that time. For those of um, them who don't know about those events, um, I think, I mean, hopefully it sort of stirs up something about wanting to learn more about it and um, what we as a, a people went through under um, New Zealand rule and German rule and that fight for independence and in that sense it's a very, it's a, it's a great play to sort of educate audiences about that but then um, also on a theatrical level I mean you know, it's really funny moments and it's you know re really kind of like moving emotional stuff it's just a really good ride for the audience to go on here. Yeah.